The Volusia County Sheriff's Office is currently searching for a man who they say abandoned a sailboat on New Smyrna Beach. West News Volusia County Bureau reporter Pamela Combs spoke with residents ready to see it gone. Somebody sent us a picture <laughs> and said, look at the shipwreck in front of your house. <laughs> and so when we got back, there it was. It's the talk of the town. An abandoned sailboat, and it's right across from Janet McGeary and her husband's home. We for thought, you know, within days somebody would retrieve it. I mean, you know, obviously it's worth some money, or it was, but nobody's done anything. But two months later, and it's still sitting out there. It's getting to be an eyesore to me. It, yeah, and kids play on it all the time, and they're going to get hurt. The owner of the boat is Michael Grimes. Today, the Volusia County Sheriff said there's a warrant out for his arrest for littering, making this the first warrant of its kind the department has issued. I'm going to refer to him as Grimey. Grimey, who is an environmental terrorist, thinks it's okay to dump on our beach and then tell the taxpayers of Volusia County, eh, you figure it out. Chitwood says Grimes was out sailing and got caught in bad weather. He then washed ashore. The next day, Chitwood says he was quoted $15,000 to have his boat pulled off the beach. Since then, he was never seen or heard from again. And there are some concerns because the longer the boat sits out here, the greater the environmental concern. You know, you don't want all that stuff in the water and on the beach and, you know, the clothes. And I don't know if the septic tank is filled or not filled, with, you know, on that thing. Who knows what else was in there? Thomas and Janet say they had some big tides last week and the sailboat shifted. They worry about what could happen with more severe weather. If we got a monster tide or a rogue wave or, you know, anything's possible, it would be on one of these walkovers. They can only hope the boat gets removed soon. Reporting in New Smyrna Beach, Pamela Combe, WASH 2 News. And Sheriff Chitwood said that legally the county is not allowed to remove the boat because it is under Grimes' name. If he is arrested and signs the title of that boat over to the sheriff's office, they can then get it off of the beach. But it could be months before that even happens.